Hi everyone! This is my new planner. Since I got it in the mail, I've been so completely happy with it. Um, it's a Kate Spade passport that I've turned into sort of like a satellite mini planner that I take with me everywhere. Um, it's commonly called Kate Dory on the Planner Addict circuit, so to speak, but it's really just a Kate Spade passport holder, and they run you about $45, which is significantly cheaper than the Kate Spade Wellesley planners, um, or even like Kiki K or Filofax. That's because it's really tiny. So as you can see, like, here's my hand. It's about, you know, like hand size. Um... I'm going to take this off. This is just like a little elastic that I have here. Um, I got it from Joann's. It's literally just a piece of like stretchy fabric, stretchy lace fabric. Um, I keep a little tag here that says this planner belongs to Aileen Matthews. It's just a little, I used a tap punch to punch that out and then laminated it and then sort of connected it there. So if I ever lose it at work or, you know, anywhere, people know where it is. So now I'm just going to take this off. This is how it looks from the side. It does not really stay closed on its own, as you can see, so that's why I keep that elastic on there. Um, my planner is very ragtag. That's just my style. I like to throw like the kitchen sink in here because it is my satellite planner. Um, I was using my Kate Spade as a satellite, but it, the personal size was just a little too big for me. Um, so this little planner is just perfect. and. You know, I, you can see sort of my little safety pins, or not safety pins, I'm sorry, paper clips uh, sticking out, decorative paper clips, but I don't mind. Um, you know, these are just sort of like throwaway notebooks that are in here, so it's okay. So when you open it up, um, the first thing you see over here is just a post-it with just like a to-do list. I didn't block anything out, so, you know, it's okay. I don't care that you guys see my plans or whatever. Um, but, you know, it's just like home, taxes, parking tickets, clean, you know, go for a run. And then I have a work list here. Um, and then I also have an index that lets me know exactly where things are inside of my Kate Dory. Um, there's a spirit section, passion, body, son, which is just actually my son, my like child. <laughs> and then there's like a home section. So I have like a little washi tape there, a little bow here, because I love bows. And when you open it up, um, that's like my name. That's just like a quick run through. Now I'm not going to show you like everything that's in here, but as you can see, it's like a little section of like a notebook here. And I have a second notebook right here. Um, this notebook is so adorable. I have no idea the brand. I need to find out because I'm going to order a whole bunch more. Um, but this is just a second little notebook here. And when you go inside, like I keep things like doctor's appointment. Since it's a satellite planner, um, I guess I'll go into that a little bit later after my walkthrough. But I just throw everything in here. Receipts, appointment reminders. I just use these little paper clips. I made this one um, and I also sell them on my Etsy shop. Uh, but it's kind of closed now because I'm still on maternity leave. But I'll link to my Etsy shop below. And this is from another Etsy shop. I'll link to that one. I have a little calendar right here. Um, it has like all of the different months on here. Um, but we're on March, so I keep it pinned to there. I got this glitter paper pin, like clothes pin thing from Paper Source. And this is just a regular binder clip that I put washi tape on. Um, and this is a tiny composition notebook back here. So um, this is just where I write like passion, writing type stuff, work stuff, um, and more to-do lists. And that's just like a tiny, that's like a composition notebook. And then back here, I have um, another calendar. It's just a laminated sort of like year at a glance. Um, and this actually came with this thing here from paper source but it was just like sort of in the packaging and I cut it out and laminated it and put some more scrapbook paper on the back um, so that I keep right back here so I'm going to leave this out for a minute because I'll also talk to you guys about how I made this. Back here, the Kate Dory also has a little pocket. I keep just like papers and stuff back there that I don't feel like, like they're too big to put in here. So I just fold them up and put them back there. So as you can see, um, I'll actually take 
this, oh, I, I won't take it out because there's other videos, better videos on how to make a Kate Dory, but I made this myself. I just laminated um, a piece of uh, scrapbook paper and then cut it to size uh, and then, you know, used, honestly, there's so, you could make a Kate Dory so much better than this, but like I said, I'm very ragtag. I didn't really care. I literally used hair elastics. So hold on, you'll see. This is literally a hairband. And I didn't sew or I didn't, you know, cut holes in anything. I literally just used hair elastics to put it together. Now, one day, you know, when I get time to, I'm going to actually sit down and make like an authentic Kate Dory, something really nice. But for the time being, I just had a kid. I'm really just sort of in need I was in need of a planner that was just really easy to make so I just did this and I just honestly I just attached this with thread um, I taped it to the back part of this so it's nothing fancy I just sort of threw everything together and um, if you guys are confused as to what a satellite planner is I'll go over that one more time it's just something you can throw in your purse um, or you can just take with you into meetings and you keep it with you everywhere you go. The reason why it's nice that it's so small is because my bigger planners, my Kiki K, my Filofax, those planners are for specific reasons. My Kiki K is my writer's journal. My Filofax is my budget journal. My other Kate Spade, I have two other Kate Spades. One is for home and one is for work. This little thing is everything it's for home it's for work it's for budgeting as I think about it during the day I literally just jot it down in here and then at the end of the day or at the end of the week depending on how busy I am I literally take things from here and I transfer it into my bigger planner um, whether it just be like I have a thought or an idea in here so I write it down and then I flush it out in my bigger a5 journal so this Kate Spade has literally brought me so much planner peace. I love it so much. It's my favorite. Honestly, it's my favorite planner. Um, it's crazy how everybody was so into the Wellesley, which I'm into that too. I think they're beautiful. But the personal size just wasn't right for me. And then all of a sudden, you know, I found out about Kate Dory's and I thought, why not? That's kind of cute. And then ever since then, um, I've just been happy. Planner peace, as we call it. So that's my Kate Dory. I hope you guys like it. Um, I'm probably going to get a, a bunch more just because that's how things work. I think I'm addicted to planning. That's it. All right, guys. Have a good one. This is my Kate Dory. I hope you enjoyed the video. Bye.